Raoul. It's Hi, nice there. to see you today. Um, I'm really interested in the BGK and we've had great support from uh, BGK as a member of IC2A. Um, so thank you for that. Um, but we'd just like to ask you about this uh, knee that you have that uh, quite a few people are asking about. All right. So my name is Raoul. I live in the Canary Islands. And um, the reason why I uh, approached uh, VGK in the first place was because uh, I have a very short stump since I was 12. And uh, the femur is very thin and the hip even is smaller than the other side. So we can go any speed up to 7.5 kilometers per hour. The average speed person would walk 5 kilometers per hour, so we are fine. Concerning speed, uh, the user has to weight maximum six, uh, maximum 100 kilograms. Considering that uh, the leg is weight, I am a 65 kilogram patient, so it still tolerates uh, more weight. Uh, you can carry up to another 40 kilograms and you're fine. And uh, it's waterproof, which is also very important for those who live in exotic places or close to the sea in summertime. <laughs> So, so what does that mean when it's waterproof then? You can go in the sea? Yes, you can walk and you can swim with it and or you can fish and you don't have to worry about it getting wet and then losing the warranty and paying uh, a large amount of money for maintenance. Oh. So waterproof, basically if it's salty water you should rinse it afterwards and that's it. And okay. you can uh, walk again. Okay, thanks so, for the information, that's so. superb. <laughs> okay, thank you. Okay, you're welcome. It's a rotator which you can fit in most prosthetics. Uh, it's very well, it's 40 grams more, than, but I, it really compensates because most, I would say, more than half of the world when they eat, they sit like this. They, they don't sit like this with them, their own leg straight. So it is a nice feature that you can fit in any other knee, but this one also allows that. And by the way, now that it's bent, uh, well, you can see my tube starts here. So you can imagine it's 11 centimeters femur. Then it's a traditional uh, vacuum. That means it's attached with a valve. In this case, it's a silicon valve, silicon socket. There's a frame with carbon fiber. And the mechanism is on top of the axis, which is one of the crucial facts. And why I want to tell you that, because when you are uh, in motion for short distances, you can really move it very easily. And there are exercises like Pilates. When you're doing Pilates, you, you don't want to have all your weight very far away from the body. So it allows you to move whatever little bone is left, the most of it. So I'm not really a runner, I'm not an athlete, I'm an amputee who has a normal life and he's doing the best with his prosthetics and really certainly I believe there's no need for uh, computers in it. Hmm? So it's really a very good name. Yes, that's it. <laughs> that's a good yeah. name. So it's a good name, yes. <laughs> it's accurate. Thank you. <laughs> okay. okay.